looks like I inherited uh, two dogs. They just came out of nowhere. I'm up here just organizing, doing some stuff, and they show up, friendly as can be. Big, beautiful dogs, right? That's right. What are you doing, exploring? Looking at everything, your new home? Huh? This is a little bit older one here. That's right. How you doing, buddy? Yeah. yeah I don't know who the owner's owner is, but like I said, they just showed up, right? You just showed up, didn't you? Come here. Come here. That's right. Yeah, look at friendly. Look at you. All friendly and everything. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Well, they're hanging out. You guys stay away from that over there. Ah, get away from that. Anyway, wow. It's cold as hell out here. <laughs> God. But all you people up north, <laughs> you guys are really getting hammered. Well, I'm trying to get a few things done up here. And I drive up and I got two dogs. <laughs> How about that, huh? Nice. Anyway, it's time to get rid of this, uh, time to get rid of this, out of this trailer. That's my job for today. Yes, yes, yes. All right, let's, let's get at it. One of those great pyramids, those dogs, the great pyramids, something like that. I got my tripod right here. Uh, let's see if I can set this thing up without screwing everything up here. Bear with me. Bear with me, guys. I'm trying to do everything one handed. Yeah, they're still over there hanging out. They were out there checking the cows out earlier. And there he is. Look at old Mr. Fun and Mr. Laugh. Oh yeah. That's right, the happy one. That's right, you're happy, huh? Checking everything out on your new home, your new homestead. You can tell there's some adventurous dogs. They've been traveling around probably for a while, you know, checking out a bunch of other, <laughs> other, other homesteads, right? Oh man. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Like I said, I'm trying to do this thing with one hand, so just bear with me. I'm trying to set up this tripod. There we go. Hopefully, it won't shut off on me. That's still rolling. Good, good. It's still rolling.
And the, the burn ban is off. We had so much rain up here in the last uh, couple of weeks that, in fact, two nights ago it rained its butt off. Everything's wet. I don't even want to bring the truck. I could back the trailer right up. I could back it up. Literally back up the trailer right to it, but I already know for a fact that I'll get stuck. I mean, this land doesn't perk, so you got to be real careful. Real careful. Ah. Nothing like a campfire on a cold day. That's what I always say. Ah. Let's see if we can get it ignited. Get it ignited is a little bit better. Actually, there's no wind, so it's not really as cold as it is. It's like, it's like right now it's 30 degrees outside. Let's see what we got here. Flame on, baby. Woo! This is from that deck I did two months ago. Looks like uh, the two dogs took off into the woods. Yeah, they're just out, they're just loose. <laughs> but they're friendly. Hope everybody's staying warm. Cause I'll tell you what, it's really, really cold. Yes. It'll catch on in a few minutes. Just gotta keep lighting it up. Keep keep lighting it up until it gets some embers in there. Oh man, look at that. Almost busted my ass. Well this is broken. Look at that. Yep. Oh. I suppose this is when you need farmer's insurance, right? <laughs> That'd have been better off. It'd have been better off if I had some kindling in here or something, but, you know. 
It'll, uh, I'll tell you what I got. Yeah, I think this wood, this wood is way too wet, way too wet to burn. Pine straw. That ain't gonna last long. Yeah, if the wind pushes it this way, it'll get into it a little bit better, but... Yeah. Okay. Well, we're almost busting my ass here, but uh, yeah, fire will bust these blocks up over time, so uh, I should have known better. <laughs> it's not like I haven't busted my ass before, but yeah, uh, the last uh, last nine days have been really good work-wise. Uh, I got a big chunk of work done at the hospital, spent 21 hours out there. Plus, I had two electrical, whew, I had two electrical emergencies that I went on. Make sure that damn thing, not burning, not burning my ass. But, uh, yeah, I went on two uh, big uh, electrical jobs and uh, got those knocked out. And uh, now, all this cold air is set in. <laughs> Getting choked out here. Ah! God, that's what I call it. That's a that's a, a wind shift there. <laughs> okay, but uh, now the second I second I come over here, the wind will shift and it'll. It'll get me again. <laughs> so, yeah, like I said, last nine days has been really productive. And now that this cold air has sat in uh, across the whole damn the eastern seaboard, uh, it, it's going to stay in the 20s, you know, highs in the 40s for the next six or seven days. And they're even talking again for snow uh, Saturday or Sunday. So this is a perfect opportunity to get a few things done up here. Uh, I'm not sure exactly, uh, unless I get an emergency call for work, uh, I really don't have to work or don't even really need to work for at least a week. Uh, I, I've made all I need to make for the whole month of January. January's taken care of. And now it's just time to enjoy uh, a little time off 
because uh, in like I said, the last nine days, 21 hours at the hospital, and at least uh, four to five hours, six hours on these two electrical jobs. So 27 hours I booked in nine days, but you know, obviously uh, I make pretty good money, so uh, I don't really need all the all 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 my stuff is covered for the month. So. That's good. I mean, and I hope everybody else is doing well out there. Uh, you know, especially if you're up north right now, uh, it, it, you guys be freezing your asses off. So uh, take care. Love you. You know that. This is me, Tom. Yeah. See, the fire's finally got finally got going. Uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Just another day on the off grid farm. Just hanging out uh, with really just trying to find things to do. That's basically it. You know, leave those comments, share, like, subscribe. Appreciate all the followers on my channel and subscribers. We're almost at that 23,000 uh, mark. And uh, yeah, uh, the uh, the other thing was, uh, uh, how's my uh, diet and exercising going? Well, I'll be honest with you. If I could sit here and squat like this without any pain, and I've already taken off so much, uh, uh, you know, just fat. Uh, off my body. Uh, I'm feeling lean, I'm feeling healthy, and I'm also stronger. Uh, but, you know, I've been working out for the last 18 straight days on top of the work. So, you know, <laughs> I've been getting a workout, let me tell you, but the big thing is the diet. Okay, the big thing is the diet. And uh, anyway, let's keep feeding this fire. I'll talk to you guys on another video. Tom out of here on the off grid farm in beautiful state of North Carolina. Uh, where the temperatures are right at about today, right this moment, about 32 degrees. Y'all stay blessed. Y'all stay tuned. Out of here.